Today we are on WWE 2K20 to crown the next world heavyweight champion. There are eight AEW wrestlers ready to go at it, a whole bunch of main eventers ready to become the next champion. And without further ado, people, let's get right into it. Round number one, Christian Cage versus John Moxley. Collar and elbow tie up, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Man, this is 2K15, isn't it? Referee having to get in between both men, but John Moxley throwing a little sneaky jab jab right there. Another color and double tie up. Standing switch by Moxley. Both men, former world champions. Christian, although, held the belt that they're fighting for tonight. As a whole bunch of AEW wrestlers are here in WWE at Survivor Series in front of this WWE crowd. Very silent, very silent right now, but maybe later on, maybe later on they're going to get rowdy. Big slap by John Moxley. At least the crowd knows who John is and Christian is. So, collar and elbow tie up once again, man. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Standing switch takes him down. John Moxley looking a little bit shooketh. Oh my God. Here he goes. <laughs> oh no. Oh, here he goes, man. Fighting in the crowd. The crowd gained their money's worth. Christian punching. Oh my God. Christian, not like this. Christian, please. Oh, thank you, God. Oh, man. This game. <laughs> Oh my God! <laughs> no, no time for posing, Christian. You gotta win a championship now. Count of seven. Oh my God! <laughs> oh my God! Please, man. <laughs> Please, man. Don't do this to me. Don't do this. They're gonna do it. They're gonna do it. Oh my God! <laughs> oh, come on, Christian. Christian just staring at this little kid. What? Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Count of eight. John Moxley kicks him, runs back into the ring. Oh my god, please, man. Just fucking end it already. <laughs> just end it. End this tournament. Oh, thank you, God. Thank you, God. Oh my goodness, man. Back into the action now. The referee having to call this match right in the middle as he goes for the inverted DDT. No stain. Takes him away from the ropes. Goes for the pinfall. Hooks the leg. First pinfall of the matchup, I believe. Two count. No, almost a three count. As John Moxley sets back up immediately, Christian still be switchered. Bill Wilford, Miss Switchard. Kill switch is engaged. Christian immediately going for the pinfall attempt. Going for the pinfall attempt already. One, two, uh, two count or <laughs> man oh man. Of course, the kill switch is also known as the unpretty year, but Christian apparently doesn't like the name for some fucking reason. Everyone wants the unprettier. However, John Moxley doesn't give a shit about that. Going for the forearms on forearms. Off the second rope into the lariat. And now we're going for the bulldog to add on to that maneuver. To that comeback. Oh, but Christian, like a snake, waits for his prey. Huge form by John Moxley as Christian is a little bit dazed right now. John Moxley going to plant him with the cradle pile driver. Pinfall attempt. By John Moxley. One, two. Ah, oh, Christian kicks out of it. It's only a matter of time until Christian or John Moxley hits them with their finish. As I say that, the paradigm shift. Oh, he's near the ropes, but I don't think that's a rope break. One, two, three. And John Moxley gets to the second round of this tournament. Second match of the tournament, Cody Rhodes taking on Stain Stain, going it right after Cody Rhodes, but Cody Rhodes already blocking it. The American Dream already living through his blood as Stain. Oh, the crowd is not liking Stain right now. Stain already a full of offense. Cody Rhodes with the backflip into the clothesline, takes him out to the outside, and the crowd pops huge. Cody Rhodes, of course, the favorite of tonight. Everyone loves Cody Rhodes. What a backdrop by Stain, giving him a big bump. 62 year old Stain back into the ring once again. Knife edge chop. Huge drop kick by Stain. Ah! <laughs> Stain, former world heavyweight champion in WCW, in TNA. Cody Rhodes, a former world champion in the Ring of Honor for the NWA. Never won the world championship in AEW or WWE, but tonight he looks to take what the WWE could have given him, and that is that world heavyweight championship. Stainer splash already. Wow. Cody's holding on. Is Cody okay? Yo, yo, ref, you gotta check on that Cody. Cody, Cody could be hurt. Cody's gonna have a kid soon. You gotta be, you gotta chill out, Steve. Steve, gotta chill out. Atomic drop takes him down a peg. Woo, indeed, Stain. Woo, indeed. You think people will be upset if Cody Rhodes beats Stain? I don't think so. I think Cody is a respectable guy. 
I think Cody is such a fantastic. I love Cody Rose. I really do. He's such a lovely, lovely person. Stainer going for the Scorpion Death Drop. Cody looks like he's out for the count. Going for the pinfall attempt. Hook the leg. Two. Ah, oh, Cody Rose still in it. That's what I'm talking about, Cody. Got to go for the real Americans out there. Staying with a huge set of offense to begin this matchup. Cody Rhodes trying to fire back, but Stain gives him the Irish whip clothesline for a response. And Stain going to go for a stomp. No, Cody able to get away from it. Catches him for a Oh, it does go for the Alabama slam, but no. Stain blocks it. Gives him a DDT instead. Wow, levels him with that drop kick. Stain is just on one tonight. You think the boys were popping steroids and cocaine in the back before Stain had his match? Maybe that's why he's so agile right now. Oh, vintage Cody Rhodes. Mad disrespectful. Oh, the referee gets out of the way. You saw how, oh, y'all, a little, little hippity hop by the referee. Anyway, Stinger splash. Cody doesn't give a fuck about that Sting. <laughs> Huge comeback from Cody Rhodes into the power slam. Going for the pinfall attempt. Hook the leg. Referee about to count this shit. Oh, it's two count. Two count. Sting. Oh, Sting. <laughs> Here it goes. Stain waiting for Cody. Oh, he threatens him with a punch, but Cody gives him a punch instead. Front headlock, front chancery. Cody Rhodes going for something. What's what? Cody. Gut wrench? Gut. Okay. All right. Gut wrench into the shoulder block. Interesting. Oh, my God. Alabama. Uh, Slamma. Now, Cody, of course, the veteran. Going for the pinfall attempt. Drags him away from the ropes. One, two, two counts. Sting kicks out. You got to do what's best, Sting. You got to put the young kid over. We got to have world champions that are like Cody Rhodes. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, but Sting. Oh, Sting. I thought Sting was going to be down, but no. He was about to get back up. Cody's going to make sure he's going to stay down for the count. Oh, my God. Here it goes. Cody going to call the cops. It is the cop. Caller, <laughs> Cody just continuing to wear down Stain. What a, what a match for Stain right now. Stain in his old ass age of 62 years old. Cody, I believe, he's not even near 40. Probably in his mid 30s. Clotheslines Cody out to the ring, out to the outside of the ring. Excuse me, pardon me. Now, if there's one thing I don't want in this matchup is a double count out. So please, for the love of God, do not do this. Of course, commentary not here for tonight because I will be your commentator for the rest of tonight. That's how we do it here on my channel it takes one cross for us, man oh cross body going for the pinfall already going for it two. Oh, oh man what a match dog ah oh, sting lying in wait cody has no clue gonna get dropped but the scorpion death drop that could be it sting could be moving on and cody's dreams will be shattered one two oh my god the huge kick out by cody rhodes cody rhodes has a lot of fight in him, but Sting has a lot of fight in him as well. Clothesline by the Stainer. Another one by the Stainer. And a third one to measure him. Into the Cody. Into the corner goes Cody. Stainer splash. God, I'm tired. Trying to go for an overhead press, but Cody Rhodes holding on to his chest. Going for the pinfall attempt. This could be it. Anything could happen in this matchup. Two. A uh, huge kick out by Cody Rhodes. I think Sting's done. I think Sting is tired as well. He wants to go home. But first, he has to put away Cody with the third Scorpion death drop. I think that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Cody's dreams has been shattered. Sting moving on to the second round. I believe he will be facing John Moxley. What, what a match is going to be because John Moxley is a dangerous dude. <laughs> So Stain better watch a neck because John's going to come after it. Brody Lee versus Brian Cage. Brian Cage and Brody Lee. Brody Lee going for it already, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That urgency. No waiting around. No calling double times. Just say, fuck it and go for moves. That's what I'm here for. Brody Lee, of course, the leader, the original leader of the Dark Order. Could have been a contender for the AEW World Heavy Championship, but John Moxley at the time, the world champion, did not hold back in his match with Lee. And now Lee is looking to become the next World Heavyweight Champion in this tournament. The inaugural World Heavyweight Champion of the tournament moving forward. It's Brian Cage. Everyone, everyone likes Brian Cage. I like Brian Cage. He looks like a star. 
He moves like a cruiserweight. But is it his time tonight as he has to get through Brody Lee, the former Harper of the WWE? Trying to squeeze down on the shoulder. Just going to squeeze down on the shoulder. Going for the pinfall attempt after squeezing the shoulder of Brody Lee. Yeah. I mean, that's a strategy. That is a strategy indeed. Going for a lariat. No. Whoa, what is this? Oh, my God. <laughs> Judgment Day. I believe that's what it's called in this game. I'm pretty sure. There's another name for it, but I just can't remember. German suplex to Brody Lee. Just a huge, huge guy. Big knee. Takes him down a peg. And there you go, Brian Cage going straight after the skull. Going straight after the skull of the leader of the Dark Order. Oh, big throw chop by Brody Lee. That's what I'm talking about, Brody. That's what I'm talking about. Brian Cage has to collect himself after just getting throw smacked. <laughs> Right, right in the in the scum off my desk, if you will. Uh, Brian K trying to get the fans on his side, but the fans don't give a fuck, <laughs> as you can tell. Continuing the tradition currently in this tournament of fighting on the outside, trying to go for a super kick, but no. Brody Lee trying to go for a body punch, no. Brody Lee, oh, Brian K trying to go for a super kick as well, but no. Brody Lee throws him to the turnbuckle, or yes, the ring post. There you go, the ring post. The ring post again, trying to go for his throat. Pro go pro <laughs> Brian Cage. That is so true, King. Count of five. Brody Lee grabs him by the back of his neck. Count of six. Hopefully they both get into the ring and it doesn't restart because I would hate to see that happen. Count of seven. Brian Cage throws him back into the ring. Uh, that's what I'm talking about. This tournament's all about the World Heavyweight Championship, but a sign of urgency between all eight competitors runs at Brian Cage and overhead belly to belly. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. Oh, my, my guy brought the phone now. He said, I got to take this picture for Twitter. Please follow me at Sins HQ. Oh, whoa, 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 What is this, Brody? Brody, Brody, what are you doing, my guy? Oh, please. Please, man. Not the power bomb on the apron, the hardest part of the ring. Trying to follow up with the sister Abigail. Wait, what? 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 I'm sorry? Mark Henry? <laughs> of course, AEW latest signee. Keeping the AEW theme alive. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Brian Gage is waiting. Just waiting. Wait, hold on. <laughs> What's going on? Lariat! <laughs> Discus, of course. Going for the pinfall attempt after just doing a whole bunch of bullshit. Count that's what, yeah, yeah, Brody Lee, that was deserving. That was deserving, of course. That is for true, my king. That is for true. Ryan Cage has him up. And down with the drill claw. Oh, but the rope break. He's so tall. He is so tall. Brody Lee's height coming into play for this matchup oh he could have caught him with the reach advantage was there but the game you know it doesn't really count it at all Brody Lee however still having the offense on his side after the distraction from Mark Henry European uppercut going for the pinfall one two okay <laughs> Brody Lee advancing Final match of the first round. Kenny Omega versus Adam Page. Oh my god. <laughs> Kenny Omega trying to get the upper hand immediately against Adam Page. Kenny Omega, the current AEW, Impact, TNA, AAA, WWE Champion, according to JR. Adam Page, future contender, future world champion for the AEW Championship. Already going for the pinfall attempt from the bicycle knee strike. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god <laughs> the second round of the gold rush tournament john moxley and stain stain doing a front <laughs> doing a front bump off the rip of course damage retention is on we're not gonna do no bs with that garbage we're gonna have them have the damage that they had in the first round and continue on up until the final match of the tournament sting bleeding 
through this base paint. Can we see it? Probably not. Stain doesn't care. Going for the clotheslines. Multiple clotheslines after John Moxon's comeback. Big Stainer splash from the corner. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh man, I can't I can't believe Omega just buried down page like that. One, two, wow. And <laughs> as I say that, Sting <laughs> moving on to the final match of the tournament. Brody Lee and Kenny Omega. If I had to put my money on anybody, it's Kenny Omega. Even with that sky high. My money's on Kenny Omega. Kenny Omega right off the gate in the first round of the match. Beats Adam Page within less than 30 seconds. That man is fresh as fuck, man. But Brody Lee, knowing what he has to deal with, just going for big ass moves, crucifix into the sit-out powerbomb. He knows what has to be done, man. He knows what has to be done. Kenny Omega is just a beast, a whole nother level. But Brody Lee's been around the parks. He's been through the trenches. He's going to go for whatever he has to do. He has to do whatever it takes. He has to do everything in his power to become the World Heavyweight Champion of the tournament. Chops the chest of Kenny Omega. Kenny rolling to the outside. Brody Lee making sure he gets everything that he gets coming to him. Gives him that suicide dive into the forearm strike. Omega, though, gives him a knife edge, ch knife ed knife edge chop of his own oh my goodness <laughs> yeah man yeah just beating the shit out of kenny omega just <laughs> making a bump on the announcer's table count of five kenny omega has a cocked and loaded waiting for brian cage's former first round competitor Brody lee to get back onto his feet referee getting to the face of kenny omega kenny omega just ignoring him Brody lee Blocking whatever, whatever Kenny Omega was going for. Big throat chop. Ooh! Running bicycle knee strike by Kenny Omega. That could put him away, but no. Kenny going right after Brody Lee's back. Trying to wear him down as much as he can. Brody Lee is a different breed. Kenny Omega knows that. He's no Adam Page. This isn't going to be a burial without a doubt. Brody Lee off the ripcord into the lariat. We're not going to call her a Rainmaker because it's not a Kozuchika counter. <laughs> bicycle knee strike by Kenny Omega. That was the bicycle knee strike that put away Adam Page for the 1, 2, 3. Will it happen for Brody Lee? 1, 2. Oh, my God. The shoulder up at the last second. A 2.9 arguing with the referee. The next thing. Oh, no way. I thought he was going to go for the one wing. Angel Kamui Goye to the face. But I think that could be the start to the finish no it's not kenny omega continuing the assault has him from the pump handle into the neck breaker jesus christ good lord continuing he's not gonna go for that one winged angel quite yet what is this this is a gory busta gory bomb oh gory submission gory special viva la rasa as they say trying to wear him down as much as he can but Brody Lee the strength of this man big arm drag huge for Brody Lee oh my goodness knife edge chop takes him to the middle of the ring one this is Kenny Omega what can you do what can you say oh my god that was such a good positioning for the one -win, one winged angel oh uh, there you see Omega gas he's sweaty this time around he's sweaty this time around people Discus Lariat by Brody Lee. That might be it. That might be all she wrote for Kenny Omega in this tournament. He's going to go on to face Sting for the World Championship. Oh, no. Kicks out of 2.9. Kenny Omega needs to find a game plan in the middle of this matchup because right now he's getting his ass worked on by Brody. Mr. Brody Lee, if you nasty. Lariat to Kenny Omega. Trying to go for the throat slap once again, but no Kenny Omega fighting out of it. Form shot, drop, kick. Or not drop, kick. Drop, toll, hold. Lariat! Lays him out. The fans are booing. I don't understand why they're booing this, this good match. This is actually a really good match between both competitors. Kenny Omega, however, doesn't really care. Going to work on the leg of Brody. Aw, oh, shit. Brody Lee 
You had a good run. It's time for Kenny Omega to face Sting. Has him one winged angel. Hooks the leg. One, two, three. Kenny Omega moves on to the tournament as he now faces Sting for the World Heavyweight Championship. This is what it's all about, people. The World Heavyweight Championship. The crown jewel of professional wrestling. Right here, the big gold. Held by many respectable men in this business. Oh, look at that. That is so sexy. So sexy. Glistening in the light. Sting. Kenny Omega, sweaty as all hell. He just <laughs> finished a match with Brody Lee. Staying at least getting a glass of water and a meal before this matchup. Ah, here it goes. Sting firing up. Knows that he could possibly walk away with the world championship as Kenny Omega having a, a crazy match with Brody Lee. Probably one of the more intense matches with Brody Lee in this tournament. Sting. Oh, I thought he was going to go for the pinfall. I thought he was going to go for the submission victory over Kenny Omega. Trying to wear him down. Trying to break his spine. But no, Kenny Omega getting out of the submission. Turns him around. This could be it. Ladies and gentlemen, the Scorpion death drop. That's all she wrote. That's all she wrote. Staying. Going on. Winning the world championship too. Oh, Kenny Omega kicking out. Omega. Oh, Wait. Yeah, 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 there we go. Kenny Omega looking a little bit switchered, be maffled, be quappled. Trying to figure out a game plan right now. Stain all, had all this time, he had all 15 minutes plus to relax. Make sure he has all, all his steroids in place for this matchup. Kenny Omega and Sting. This is what dreams are made of, people. If Stain was still in his prime, holy fuck, that would have ruled. This would probably be a, an insane matchup. Oh, count of eight. Oh my god, please do not do this to me. Count of nine. Stain so old. Oh, Kenny Omega. Maybe shows a little bit of respect to the Sting Meister. The Stinger. <laughs> god damn, just let the match end, please. I'm trying to sleep. Big bicycle kick. Oh, inverted Frankensteiner. Please. For the love of God, don't do this to me. <laughs> do not do this to me. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. Sting, you son of a bitch. Okay, let's go for it one more time. Drop kick. <laughs> ah. <laughs> yeah, this game rules. Sting, Lariat to Kenny Omega. Bump and feed, bump and feed, kid. Lariat once again. We are not clocking out until we get a world champion, people. No matter what it takes. Staying off of that big maneuver, going for the pinfall attempt. One, two. Oh, <laughs> Kenny Omega's eyes said it all. He said, do I let him pin me and so I could go home and play some some Valorant? Or should I go, should I go for this world title? Add more to my collection. Kenny Omega off the ropes. Big clothesline. Stain staggering onto the corner. The crowd's not happy. They're like, why the fuck are we watching this? Please, I want to go home. I got to beat the traffic. Oh, bicycle knee strike to Sting. One, two, Kenny Omega. Gonna get to play some Valorant tonight. And adds more to his collection as he is now the world heavyweight champion. You said it best, Greg Hamilton. You said it best. Look at that. Kenny Omega now the world heavyweight champion. And there you have it. Kenny Omega wins the world heavyweight championship. Has beaten Adam Page in quick succession. Se 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 yes. Brody Lee as well. And has gone to a double count out into the final fall against Sting. And is now on top of the mountain on 2K20.